Hi Libra, welcome to this Tower Love Reading. My name's Sophia. Welcome to this community. So Libra, I've posted an additional reading on uh, uh, the Facebook group. Uh, I uh, post additional ones if you like my readings. Also those are up on this uh, channel. Also post additional readings well, on here, on the Facebook and obviously on their channel. So if you want more from me or others, check out the Facebook. I'm going to create, a, a, you'll see this week, I'm going to release a video about procrastination, laziness, uh, motivation, that kind of thing. Because I'm sure that there's some of you that want to actually make changes. Why don't you? So I'm going to create a video about that. It's going to be cheap, 10 or 15 quid. So the intention is to get you started. Then you, we can help you in this community to get onto your path, to get onto your purpose to get your person, to find love, that all kind of thing. Why don't you start that? So I'm doing a program about that. Then I'm going to do some other programs, narcissism and all these other kind of programs. I'm, well, not really programs, but, you know, other things that you can work on, addictions. I'm going to do uh, other programs to come, plus working on the shelter in the background. All right, so let's jump in. <clears throat> Three of Swords. I haven't had that for a while, but I'm picking that up lately. Yep. So let's jump in. Queen of Swords, Three of Swords, High Priestess, Four of Swords. So what I'm getting, then I'll jump into these, is you've cut off your person. And to me, you're like, you're sticking to it until there's changes this time. Oh, sorry bit chilly <laughs> it's like nope i'm not having it there's something about yeah why are they connected i would feel your heat working on yourself uh, but you don't understand yeah Okay, what I'm getting is you're working on yourself and something's happened that you've cut off your person. You don't understand it because you're working on yourself. The high priestess. It's to do, this is to do with mental thinking. This is lies, this is indecision, this is I'm getting a bit more it's not even channeled message. They say it's not channeled, but I'll say it's channeled message. I don't like to say what they say it's not, but I don't and sometimes when you get messages from upstairs, there's not words for it on this planet. <laughs> so I'm like, well what could I say? Because I say channel message, they say no, it's not channeled. Anyway, this is what I'm getting here. It's a bit weird. Is Oh, yes, it's definitely logic. There's loads of swords in this reading. And swords are logic, overthinking. And it's like, all right, the truth is I love this person. And this is your person, let's just say. And then I'll go to your tree. Um, but, and I'm always saying but is ass because that's what your butt is, right? Ass. So there comes the shit. But I've got a job and I've got kids and I've got family and I've got bills and I've got a cat and I've got this and I've got that. There's the butt, right? This planet don't give a fuck about the butts. They like, what's your truth? The Ace of Swords. You follow your truth, right? That's it, right? <clears throat> and it's the same with you. You're doing your healing, but it's what sort of healing is this? Is your healing looking good? Look at her. Look, she looks quite good, right? There's something about your person went towards something that looks good. That's what I'm getting as well. On paper. <coughs> and they're using the bullshit excuses of the little, because I'm getting loads of swords here. But to me in readings, when swords are down, it's lies. The Ace of Swords, the actual truth, is up. And this is the main, you, what is the truth of this, the matter? 
So what I'm getting is all these little swords. I'll show you. <laughs> these swords here, look, they're pointing down. The sword pointing down. Sword, sword, swords pointing down. And all these seven of swords pointing down. So, but which way was the reading? I don't know. <clears throat> so this is, oh, it's like that, I think. So this is like all these little, little lies, right? Is what you are both doing, right? Unless you're working on yourself, um, to override the bulls. This is self sabotage. This is excuses. This is I want to be a singer, but I I can't. You know, I can't afford to take the lessons. I can't do it for now. I've got children. Most people who are successful in life are rags to riches. They just find a way. This is you both not finding the way to follow your truth. So you're here with like, well, I'm looking good. I'm feeling good. Why was there deception? Because of the Queen of Swords is first, then the Three of Swords and the, and, and the High Priestess. So there's something that you had to go back that's hurt you and you know back to the healing stage. Why was the deception? Well, the deception is because this yeah there it is thank you upstairs right this is about you thought you looked good and your person would choose you whatever version of what you're doing so it mirrored back to your person is choosing the situation that looks good for in it for piece of paper so whatever you're thinking that is looking good is not it's not working on you and your person's not working on them and this is too much thinking there's no fucking love here. This is a twin flame. Of course there's love. There's no fucking cups on this. This is logic, 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 logic. I know this is a fucking Libra, but it doesn't matter, right? This is the example. Libras and Taurus is, is the all-encompassing of what this planet is. Love and balance. That's why... Um, but people confuse it with the Empress. No, it's not the Empress. The Emperor and the Empress is the fake twin flame. The High Priestess is here. So you think you are the High Priestess. Well, why is there too heartbreak? There's someone here who thinks they're doing the work that's not doing it correctly. They're lying to themselves. The Hanged Man is about... Now you're stuck in an uncomfortability. Wanting to jump into the... Uh, yeah, you didn't jump into it fully. You're healing. The Twin Flame situation since two, three months ago, since Twin Flame number two come in, right? This is how the Twin Flame is now. They've made it easier, right? Because the Twin Flame contract is called the 5D free will experience because this planet is each person's free will. They've noticed that the feminines is more fucked up. Uh, that's my words. I've got to make that clear because um, I can't say, you know, they, they shit out. But still, that's my words in the twin flame connection because they are love. And this planet is about love. So we stick to our person longer with the love. So what they've done is like, OK, your person stays to a third party situation. So there's some lies and deception here about something could be a third party. Yep, your person's lying about a third party here, right? And um, so what they've done is like, okay, well, if your person chooses not to come towards you, this is how this works. You know you're supposed to do mission. That's it. So you work on loving yourself, following your path, being a humanitarian, whatever your mission is, which this community can help you to do. And then more you love yourself and doing more, I'll give it for my example. So don't feel like I'm cussing you out, although I don't really care about that. <laughs> right. But if I'm loving myself, I'm working on my mission. I'm, I'm helping people on planet Earth. I'm making programs, blah, blah, blah. That's what I love to do. That's my kind of thing. That's my path, my calling. Right. My person stays over there. Right. Doesn't come towards me. That's his free experience to do. 
But because I'm loving myself, the contract that changed from two months ago is they're going to give me someone else. So why am I saying that? Is because then you don't worry about what it looks like to others, to your person, to whatever. I got up on my channel and I do what's good for me. Now, my person, when I spoke to him about my channel, which I rarely ever do, to be honest with you, he does ask about work. Um, he says he I say do you watch my videos he says only the ones that I talk it's been about a year since I've done talk videos that's this reading it's like I don't it's not that I don't care but I don't care if he likes them I don't go out there intentionally to do things to make him watch me to come towards me there's no manipulation i do it when i feel to now i'm now feeling to do more chat videos so you will actually see me more chatting on the the community right and the next one is going to be about the divine masculines why is it so hard to nail them but my point in this reading is the first card is this is about something about show so your person goes to someone who shows to the world that I'm a good person because they're self, they haven't got, in, they're insecure, they haven't got enough self-worth to say, fuck off, I'm going for my ones. Because I don't care about who who looks at me and how I look and what, you know, what it looks like to other people. I don't give a shit. But your person does, so you do. So you're doing something that is a show. I don't care if you don't feel like you look attractive whatever you're like oh, well, i'm being a fake spiritual leader to show to my person that i'm really good at astrology i'm really good at tarot to show to the baby's mums because they watch you as well that you're amazing something like that show what i do i do because i feel to do it. there's no show right and that's what this reading is there's deception to your person and deception on you on you following your truth and there's something here about inner child with both of you to be honest but it's not fuck all to do with your person you leave them alone right let them learn their lesson over there because your person i feel there's a third party here that they're lying to you they're not telling you about right no it's not they're not telling you they're correcting you they're lying to you about it now it's interesting because their versions of lies is well, I'm not telling you, so I'm not lying. It's still a lie, right? But they think they're not telling you, so it's not like, do you see what I mean, right? It's very, very deep when it comes to the masculines. But it's both stem from an inner child that um, didn't know love. So you both love from attention. And this attention is from logic. And this logic is what you think from the physical world because logic isn't the inside world, logic from the outside of world of what to do to make someone love you, or so you have a better something, so you're logicating this, and all it's doing is bringing heartbreak, 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 the fourth card here is about, yeah, like I said, you're not jumping in fully into your healing, which creates heartbreak, you might have an inner knowing about this situation with your person. There's a third party. Now, I don't feel that your person is loving the third party. This is definitely, like I said, a show of the third party. So, oh, got gone back to or remained in this third party because you didn't jump in fully with the healing what you had to do. Yeah, yeah, on both sides. So let's get a, uh, a little bit more about this. Yeah, there it is, the moon. Yeah, like I said, they don't lie, but they don't tell you neither. Which they, they, they use, which is manipulation, really, seven of swords. But you say, well, I've removed it. I've, I've done your course and I've brought your program, Sophia, on sexual abuse. So I've healed myself. So you're lying the same way. But have you done the health program? No. Have you done the master program? No. So you're lying the same way here. Universe wants you to know moon card, seven of wands, nine of wands. 
So you're both defensive in your own ways about your darkness, about your what's hidden, about your shadow work, right? That's what it is. And like I said, if it comes to the point where you're doing it and your person still leaves you in the dark, still lying, still, still, to me, it's with the two pillars here, they're middle ground. They're, they're over there and they want to be with you at the same time. They're over there and um, and they are with you. That's how it is. It's evil or. They're not happy over there in that situation. Because if they were, I would be saying, listen, this person's happy. What are you doing? You need to chip. But this is a light worker, star seed, twin flame situation. Right? That's why I never say that. This is about uh, defending, both of you defending your shadow work. Now, I repeat, you don't need to tell your person about their shadow work and what you need to work on. I used to have that loads of times when I first started this community. People tell me, I told my person to work on their sexual abuse. I used to get these people say, I told my person they need to heal themselves. I was like, what the fuck? When you're not even healed and you're telling someone else to heal? Oh, my gosh. This is about you doing the work more on yourself. And stop defending it with your half ass excuses this is about the truth so the truth is to you now that's listening do you think you've done enough work on yourself and if you're not sure go to the website and check out my programs and check out everything on their mission and counseling and if you've done as much as me right then you wouldn't worry two shits it will still hurt you because you're connected to someone right you're connected to someone but if they leave or they're over in another situation, right, you'll move past it knowing, OK, well, that's their free will. There's a list, lesson there still. to. to I'll, I'll put it another way. You're not moving forward. Right. So you're not ready. So they're not ready. Right. But if you are doing it like me, I'm like, OK, it doesn't matter. I'm getting a new one. So be it. Solar plexus, Mars, trying to control the situation, right? That's what you're trying to do, Mars. Personality, self-esteem, gut instincts, wisdom and power. Think you know it, but at the same time, you know you ain't doing everything. You're not doing it. You still, there's some block here. There's something that you're not doing. And it's to do with the inner child. And it's to do with confidence, I feel. Let's close it out. Libras and Taurus, always my longest readings. Because this is about what it is of this planet. I really do want us to work out. I needed to make sense of this connection. You're so different to what I'm used to, but I love that. That's what your person would like you to know. So like I said, well, did I say? Counseling is only 35 quid. Start with that. And then, you know, move on and let's figure out what's this block here that's not moving you forward. And stop lying to yourself, right? High Priestess holds the tarot, the scroll of truth, right? Ace of Swords, the truth. What is the truth that you, what you lie in, Seven of Swords? Because your person's lying that they love this person or they, they're lying to themselves. We know that already. What are you lying about? Right? If you know what it is, you need to work on it. You're obviously not, so get help. If you don't know, once again, book us. We can help you to find it out. Speak to you later.